Well, the coach arrived on time, but the bus broke down. Can you believe it? In round nine, it was a case of planes, trains and automobiles for the Swans. A broken down bus forced players to find alternative routes to the MCG to open the Indigenous round against Collingwood. They hadn't beaten the Magpies at the ground since 2000, but very quickly showed that was about to change in 2013. Kick is on the way and that's nice, very nice. After trading goals early, the Swans, led by a best on ground Adam Goods, exploded. It's a goal. Is the advantage played here? I think it is. Booting 10 goals to one from the end of the first quarter to the start of the last opened up a match-winning lead for the reigning premiers. 400 AFL goals to that man. Bolton kicks inside the 50. Off hands lurking at the back. Morton turns around, wants to bounce this one through, and this time he pulls it off. With the Magpie forward line proving ineffectual, Sydney repeatedly hurt Collingwood on the counter-attack. Chopped off by Malcheski. With Nick Malcheski, Daniel Hanabry, Kieran Jack and Ryan O'Keefe all enjoying a night out. Hanabry twisting and turning. Back to Malcheski. Cute kick and a good one to Mumford. Their 47-point victory took them to 6-2 for the season and still in touch with the top two. What a handball. What a goal. They're having a night out. Jack Hanabry at home. A rain-soaked SCG greeted Sydney and Essendon for their Round 10 clash. But the conditions mattered little as the home side produced early scoreboard pressure. Hurry kick, Mumford, what follow-up, it's a goal! Shane Mumford caught the bomber defence snapping and Nick Malcheski also found touch around goals, giving the Swans the early running. Malcheski, yeah, that one's better, that one's on line. The crowd's roaring as the young fella comes on to make his debut. Tommy Mitchell, good luck to him. Tom Mitchell made an immediate impact on debut when he was subbed on during the second quarter, first setting up Kieran Jack. Mitchell, Kieran Jack has been as good as anyone today. It's all about taking your chances. Able to go forward, Mitchell again takes the mark from Smith, sets them up. I don't think he quite got all of the kick, but Goods! before Adam Good slotted the first of his four goals as the Swans maintained their advantage. You can sit back and enjoy it. He's put it through on the Swans lead by 18. The Bombers remained in the hunt after the main break, but they met with heavy resistance. Oh, look at that for a crunch. Through the likes of Nick Smith and Heath Grundy. This defence quickly turned into attack. Mitchell kicked the first of his career. Tom Mitchell, what a debut! while Josh Kennedy continued his fine form this season. So Kennedy, he's done enough, he's steered it through. The Swans pulled away in the last quarter, notching a 44-point win and a return to the top four. Yeah, Malcheski and McVeigh have been the two stars of the game for me. 